Around the city of Portland, Ron Sloy is about as close to an A-list celebrity as we've got. I'm not selling Netflix right now. I have a tendency to buy stocks that are undervalued. Sloy owns an investment advisory firm up and down the West Coast and has appeared on numerous cable business shows, including CNBC and over the years, even here on Coin. But one random incident nearly six years ago has turned Sloy into a bit of a cult figure for one of the most popular shows on any channel, TNT's Inside the NBA. So, uh, really oh, tan. Oh, yeah. Really oh, tan Portland oh, pen is actually, hey oh, guys, is actually Ron Sloy. And Ron, thank you. Thank you so much for joining us from Portland. It really tan Portland. Come on, man. Portland can. Come on, man. Yeah, he, he looking fly, man. He looking fly. Oh, he looking fly. Come on, Come on man. Uh, it's funny, this tan can. You know, I've been in Hawaii, San Francisco. Go, excuse me, and I'll be checking through an airport or whatever, and somebody go, can I ask you something? Are you that tan can guy? And I, I, my wife and I are overwhelmed, like, seriously? What started as the guys being a bit condescending towards Sloy has now turned into a weekly reference or two or even three. Uh, Kenny Smith walks out and says, hey, guys, here we go. We, we got a present here from really tan Portland can. And then Ernie said, let's open it up. And they started spraying it and there you go. And Shaq, Chuck, Kenny, and Ernie are all fixated on this, and it is just wonderful TV. Hi, I'm Shaquille O'Neal. If you want to smell gooder than a mug, Portland tan can cologne. Really tan Portland tan. I don't know why. They just keep bringing it out. Sloy's wife, Shawnee, is always forward thinking. So for one of his recent birthdays, she decided to have a lab in Italy make Sloy his very own cologne. The really tan Portland can. Uh, brand of uh, colognes. I might endorse this. And this cologne has been a massive hit, especially at the exclusive Madison Club in La Quinta, California, where Sloy hangs with some of the sports world's biggest names. Well, they just asked me, I think, uh, a couple weeks ago, Ronnie, any chance we could get five bottles for the locker room? But for all of the fun and shenanigans, there's also been a massive void in Sloy's life for the last seven years now. If I could turn the clock back and take my 15 minutes of fame away. I would love to give my big boy a hug and, and tell him I miss him. I miss him every day. Starting at one forward, 6'7", from Longwood College, number 25, Jerome Percy. This all happened because of him. We had a love affair and he's going, hey, if you think I forgot about you because I'm, I'm not sitting next to you, I did it. Sloy and the former Blazer great were best friends. In fact, over the years, Sloy and Kersey would see Barkley and Shaq in Vegas and LA. Oh, we're so seriously? kind to uh, treat us in L.A. to the Century Club uh, and uh, a couple other. We went to you took us up. Him. You took me up to the Forum Club. And, uh, and there's an old I saying that any PR is no, good PR. And for the millions Jack, that tune in every Thursday for Inside the NBA, this is really the pinnacle. Charles and Shaq, but Jerome had a special. And Ron was kind enough to even send me a bottle of his fine cologne. Just like Shaq, I'm going to spray it to my heart's delight. <laughs> you, they're not for sale, so you're just going to have to trust me that it smells really, really nice. But thanks to Ron Sloy for giving me a little bit of time and, of course, for being such a great sport.